Hey there, it's Josh Hardy with Hardy Brothers Outdoors. If this is your first time here, welcome back. If you're uh, returning, thanks a lot for your support and uh, we appreciate you being here. So I wanted to talk about my LT35 wood miser not starting. So I've had troubleshot some problems in the past that were a little more extensive than what I'm running into right now. Uh, but this has been sitting for some time over the winter. I would love to be using it more. We haven't used it as much as, as we'd hoped to but uh, I bought it for the long haul, so we will be doing more projects. I came out, I started to try to turn it over, and uh, it just wouldn't turn over. So after about five minutes of cranking on it, I was worried about draining the battery too much. So I started doing some physical checks. One, I knew that my fuel was good because I had put stabilizer in it uh, and ran that through at the end of the season last year. Uh, two, I've got an on-off switch here for my fuel that I usually turn off. Uh, so I wanted to make sure that the, the needle or the pointer on that was pointed straight up and in line with the tube, uh, which it was. Uh, but I noticed in my fuel filter that it looked dry. Couldn't see any fuel in it. So I tapped on it. Yeah, I didn't take it apart, but I, I was pretty certain it was dry. Something that I've had to do before was take off the fuel line. So there's a pipe uh, clamp here that comes off very easily, and then I was able to wiggle the line free. And uh, I've got a, uh, a device that I can pump air. First thing I did was pump the air back into the tank just to make sure that the tank uh, line was clear coming into the line. And then uh, out of simplicity, I just took this into the hose and blew into it until I heard fuel bubbling in my fuel filter. I went back, checked my fuel filter. I could see that it was half full. So then I proceeded to turn over the engine again. Uh, three, four attempts, I could see the fuel line increasing. And uh, after about uh, probably seven or eight attempts, I got my first uh, turnover on the engine, messed with the choke a little bit, and then got it to, to uh, turn over and start running. Once I got it running, I let it run for about 15 minutes just to make sure that my battery got recharged from all of that effort of trying to turn it over. And um, had uh, good luck with it so far. So. Uh, came back out this morning, it fired right up. So for some reason I'm losing uh, fuel out of the fuel filter, not sure why that is. Uh, if you know, leave a comment down below. But if you're having struggles getting it to check, uh, getting it to turn over, I suggest checking your fuel filter first. And then if you don't have fuel in there, a simple way is just blowing the, the fuel that's in the line back up uh, into that and then you've got your suction again. Hopefully this is helpful to you. If it was, hit that like and subscribe. If you just enjoy sawmilling or the outdoors, consider subscribing as well. We've got a lot of content here and we plan on getting the wood miser out and running a lot more this year than we have in the past. So thanks a lot for watching. Have a great day and we'll see you next time.